It's called the Green Club. It's basically an environmental consciousness club. It runs year round. It kind of the way the programming goes is in these ten week sessions. That's just how the that's how we set up our our um, our programming for for at the base daycare services. And so this kind of programming can be anything. It can be photography club. It can be animation club. It can be art club or whatever. This one happens to be the Green Club. So I'm running this program even in the winter. So I'm teaching them anything that I can think of that's related to the environment that that I and my colleagues think is interesting. So you know, it could be anything from tree identification to bringing in uh, vermicomposting to cooking classes that are healthy cooking classes to to uh, plant propagation. So starting more house plants in the school, kids taking stuff home like that. When it comes to the garden, it's really kind of an eight month timeline and it starts uh, in March where we start our seedlings indoors. All the schools have grow lights inside. So we raise pretty much most of our seedlings indoors. They take care of them daily. Uh, they plan the gardens, like we have garden beds here. And so each garden bed is assigned to a group of uh, two or three students. They choose the plants, they start their seedlings, they repot their seedlings, they bring them outside. They have a whole kind of plan that they do. Um, so then they get into planting, you know, the garden, taking care of the garden, building trellises, getting kids to do woodworking. And a lot of the schools, we, that would get them to help build all the signs that you see in the garden are built by uh, the students and painted. And a lot of the woodworking they even get, they do with basic saws and drills. I always get the kids to do that. They love it. That's almost like their favorite thing. Um, then we do some food uh, transformations. We've done pickling, we've done infused oils and, and vinegars. Um, seed saving, uh, drying teas, having to, uh, we do a harvest party at the end of the year where we just like have a whole bunch of the tea we grew. Uh, there's a lot of different composting, composting, there's a school-wide composting at this school that we started and the Green Club actually takes care of it. Um, yeah, so those are some of the, some of the things that I can think off the top of my head.